Okay, if you're curious about this game, here's some information. Right now it's at uh, version 1.01, 1 .01, 883 megs. Reminds me a lot of an old PC game called Q Club. It's single and local player only. There's no online. So for the single play, got these varieties you can practice. It doesn't cost you anything to practice. If you win a game, you get 100 coins. If you want to play amateur level, it costs you 200, but you can win 400. And up it goes. Tournaments cost you to enter. If you finish within a certain level, one to four, you get a reward. So it may cost you a thousand to enter, but depending on where you place, you may get 915 coins. Multiplayer is local only. Speed just has you trying to clear the board as fast as you can. Shop. You can use your coins to buy a variety of cues. I've been playing the game with the same cue that I started with. I don't know if any of these would make that much of a difference. There's quite a few of them. You can also have different ball sets. That's about all you can use your coins on. The game has music, but it's only in the menu. There's no music when you're playing the game. The controls are basically you fine tune your aim with L2, you move with the left stick, square brings you up English option, and that's about it. Challenges. Every day you get up to three. You complete them and you get coins. So I've already done two today and I've got one left. So if I were to finish this one, I'd have no more challenges. Keeps track of your stats, but just you. That's it. It doesn't uh, keep track of your friend's stats. Or another player stats. Show you some quick gameplay. You can't pick um, the difficulty level other than here. So if you want to play hardcore professional, you have to pay the entry fee to get in. When you just play regular. you get uh, a little bit of a cheat that you can see where the ball is going to go. You play in the harder levels, um, professional level you just get a line and in hardcore mode I don't think you get anything. Now there's a timer. If you look at the uh, cue ball in the middle there's a green bar above it and once that runs down you have to take you have to take your shot within that time. Um, I've never had a problem with it. You can get different cues. It'll give you extended time. As you see it running down, actually it's the blue the blue bar, but it's never been a problem for me. 
So you can't pick the difficulty level except by paying to get in, and you can't pick your opponent, and you can't pick the tables. But that doesn't matter. Um, So if I would have won this game, I would have got some XP, I would have got some coins. You level up right now, I'm, it shows 8, but what happens is once you hit 50, uh, once you go beyond that, you prestige. So right now I'm at prestige 8, um, so it goes up. There's some trophies. I think 21 trophies. They're all bronze. Some of them are kind of fun. Um, I like it. I played it for about, I don't know, 12 hours. I haven't got bored of it. I think it's 13, 14 bucks. Uh, just know what you're getting. Um, if you want, you know, the best pool game on the PS4. This isn't probably it. Um, Hustle Kings is it, but you know if you like the overhead pool game, this is pretty fun. Just uh, understand the limitations. You know, you're playing a friend, or you're playing the computer, and that's about it. Uh, you're playing for these trophies. You're pay playing for some coins to buy some cues that may or may not affect your gameplay. Different ball sets. It's basically just for fun, but. Uh, I think I got my money's worth. I like it. That's it.